how do you measure the success of a CICD pipeline? The success of a CICD pipeline can be evaluated based on several key matrices like lead time for changes. What that means? The amount of time it takes from core commit to the core being deployed in production that is known as your lead time for changes. How much time it takes? Right? When you started writing a code or when you committed the code and the time it is taking to deployed in the production that is your lead time for changes. Deployment frequency. So, more frequent deployments usually point towards a more efficient and responsive development process. So, if you are doing a frequent deployment, so that is also a plus point for your CICD pipeline. Okay. Then time to recover from failures. So, if something goes wrong, how quickly you can restore the service? Quicker recovery times generally means your pipeline is well architected to handle failure scenarios. If anything is not working fine, how early you can restore the service? That is the one of the success criteria for your CICD pipeline. Okay? 